An ache from what? An ache from the limbs. Absolute mental. Hey guys, Swift Boy here. Now, today, back with a brand new video. Rotherham face Bristol Rovers today at home. Absolutely buzzing. We are top of the league, so we are top of the league. Come on, let's hopefully we stay there today. Beat Rovers, Bristol Rovers, obviously. It's a must win game. As I said, we're top of the league. I'll show you which teams we need to win today because it's so tight at the top of the table. We're literally joint first. We're top, Wickham are second. Literally, we're winning on goal difference because we are the top goal scorers in the league. Speaking of goals, Calvacell got the goal of the month, actually, versus Peterborough. The overhead kick, what a, what a goal that was. So, as I said, it's a must win game. We need Donny, Donny. Gillingham, Trammy and Rochdale all to win and we need obviously us to win. Absolute buzzing score prediction we've got to win today. Bristol Rose in 12th. It's probably going to be a, be a bit of a trickier game than people are expecting. I think they're going to score. I think we're going to be too good for them though today. I think it's going to be 3-1. We're not normally that good at home. We normally have a really bad first half, a quality second half. Hopefully it's a quality 90 minutes this week. As it was last week when we were 3-0 up at half-time versus Oxford. Up the Miller, let's go. Meeting Charlie into the pub before the game. Absolutely pumped. It should be a good atmosphere today. We're top of the league. I've actually never seen Rotherham play a game where they're going in top of the league. If we can hit 50 likes, would we'll be much appreciated. Also, subscribe. That would be much appreciated as well. We've currently hit... 4,550 subscribers. We're actually only something like 2,000 behind Rotherham's actual YouTube account. That is absolutely mental. Up the Millers, come on. Charlie, the return of uh, John to Clark Harris, do you think he's going to score today? Yes. And 1 out of 10, how much do you think he's going to score? 10. Up the Millers? No. What do you mean, no, up the Millers? You're a late fan. <laughs> <laughs> right, score prediction, Robin vs uh, Bristol Rovers. No. So, scorers. Come on! on the first half. Boring. Yeah. We're, sitting the ball. We're getting caught out easy. That's what I said at the start of the video. We normally have a terrible first half, second half we come out, we've got to go from corner now. But you're here at home with another one where you're in. Oh, so true. Come on. Absolutely. We've got to quick see to score. Go on. We'll never score from direct corners and don't make us like the minute after we've taken one. Battle of Sunday crossing it in here. Come on. Cheers, Jeff. Cheers, Jeff. Two!
A date from what? A date from the limbs. Absolute mental. Come on. Oh! Do you need a scores in the I'm not going to allow to record, I might do more video here. So if I don't end, if I don't film any more video, I might make a sit down video about it. Absolutely ridiculous. Right, this is where I'm going to end the video. The match finished 3-0 to the middle, top of the league. Unfortunately, I couldn't get the third goal on camera because Bit of, an in, bit of an incident with the stewards, basically. They were staring at the top. So I said to my mates, do you think she'll just go down just to see what's just to see what's up? And they said, yeah, go on then. So I went down, turns out they was looking at me, vlogging the game, absolutely absolute ridiculous. I've been doing it for like four years, never had any trouble. Stadium manager even knows that we do it. He definitely knows Charlie used to do it. There's so much more things going wrong with football at the minute, racism, stuff like that and the picking on a young lad vlogging the football, doing something he loves, trying to give Rotherham United a good name, everyone thinks our fans are absolutely shit, I've vlogged the game and then I get people saying your fans are actually decent. Spoke to my clickway after the game as well, he thought I was joking, he generally thought I was joking. Players know that I do it as well, it's just nothing, it's not even a big deal, even though I guess they've got a job to do and stuff like that but he doesn't take six stewards circling me, the lankiest piece of thing you've probably ever met. Absolutely ridiculous, gonna have, to, gonna have to have a meet with the stadium manager. Nothing to complain about, three points, up the middle, it's a good one. Peterborough away next week, full of deal, we better win that. Jointly, joint top, we are top though, just because of goal difference. Unfortunately, Wickham scored, I think it was like in the last minute or something like that. To remain second, we've got to win every game, he's got to, got to win now. Julian Lammy making his appearance as well. Such a, He's probably one of the nicest people Rotherham have to speak to after the game. He's literally got so much time for the fans. And he shakes around loads of, he's, he's absolutely quality. I'm just, I'm just gutted about what happened with the Vogue thing today. Not even a problem, I literally could be, I literally could be going to the football doing a lot more worse things, but I'm not, I've just got a camera doing something I love. Even some of the stewards know that I do the vlogs. Even some police officers know that I do it. Literally walk past them at the end of the game and be saying, I'm looking forward to your vlog tonight. There's just no problems, but then there's a sake, stewards. Absolute, that was ridiculous to be fair. Anyway, up the millers. I'll see you in my next one. Peter Brewey, come on.